Hello, this is Spidey1958, and welcome to my Let's Play Industrial Automation. Uh, last episode, we got our uh, quantum boots and our quantum helmet. This episode, I'm going to concentrate more on build crap. I think it's time to start building some of the stuff so I can use the new features of uh, Buildcraft 3. So, first thing I need to do is build, I'm going to upgrade this source here. So it's a little bit more uh, hefty. So let's go ahead and do this. And we'll need to move the switch. And, uh, of course, I forgot to get some more red wire, so let's request some of that here. Whoops. Have to click on the right thing. I think I have some. Oh, maybe I don't. Let me check my uh, bag here. Nope, oh, looks like I'm going to have to go make some red wire quick, so let's run over to my other building. Okay, so I'm going to need... Uh, let's see. Got one there. So let's request two copper and eight redstone. Someday I should figure out a way to automate using this too. And there's one. Just wait for a second one here. I have played with the sound settings. I'm hopefully have finally fixed the sound not syncing. We'll see here uh, how this episode does, but uh, it worked okay in my test, so hopefully it's now fixed. And that should be enough wire for our needs. Let's run on back. We. Okay. Put our switch down here. And so we'll need to put another one here, another one here, and then put down our engine here. Usually the water source is good for about uh, three engines. And I've only been running two, so we'll see how we do with the uh, extra. I thought I had, there we are. And we need to force an update here. Yeah, well, there seems to be an issue with gold pipes, the water pipes, they don't automatically update, but if you force an update through almost any way, and it looks like I only have one of those, so let's go ahead into my bag of tricks. 
and pull out our diamond saw here. Oops. That looks neater. And probably right. Let's see, where do I want it? So the centered. Let's say right here. I'm going to bring in a new water source. So let's find my correct pipes. Okay, let's run outside and set up a new pump. Whee. And I didn't bring any stone with me. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back here. Let's go ahead and get our pump set up here. And it's the pretty much the standard pump setup that I use. So, go here. Now I know I know some people have been having problems with uh, infinite water sources running out, and that hopefully, since I'm using a natural one, it won't happen here. So, but we'll keep an eye on it anyway, just to make sure. And let's go ahead and put our pipe there. And let's figure out what I'm going to do here. On the water pipes, I'm using gold pipe because I want to keep the flow constant so I don't overheat. And uh, the stone pipes just don't carry as much as the gold does as fast. So could be an issue. Eh, not exactly what I wanted, but out of work. So let's go ahead and go inside and start getting our other stuff placed. Okay. I want those there. So let's do this a little different. Let's go ahead and run this down here. And then down here. And do I have any teleports on me? Nope. I'll need to get a teleport pipe here. Let's go ahead and put down our engines. And there's our conductive and our wooden conductive. And actually, I'm probably, there's some more gold conductive. So let's go ahead and put a stone down here.
And we'll put down our gold here. Down some cable here. Need to build a lever. I don't have that, so let's go ahead and request the other things I need here. A couple teleport pipes and such. And do I have teleport pipes? Yes, I do. So let's request. Well, let's request all four of those. And some redstone. And do I have a lever? Nope. So let's request a stick. And okay. So let's make two of these. Power transports. And I think in my bag I have some waterproofing. I guess I don't have any waterproofing in there, so let's go ahead and request a couple of those. I always have problems spotting it. Should be on this page. There it is. I just switched to craft because that's easier. So I'll need two of those. Okay. Wait for that. We'll take our power teleports here. Put it there. And I'm actually going to put, whoops, a couple here. And let's get our wrench out. Well, first of all, let's make our lever here. And get our wrench out. Okay, put down our lever here. Turn over here. Hold on a minute, I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that, I'm back. Let's go ahead and make these waterproof teleport pipes. And if you're wondering why I'm doing teleport pipes for short distances, the teleport pipes lets me be flexible for redirecting power and stuff like that, so. And let's go ahead, we're going to stick one of the power teleport pipes right here. Or, not power, liquid. And we'll go ahead and set that one for, well, let's see what we haven't used. We'll set that one for four. And we'll go over here. And put this one down. And that way we can set it, through. I can either use the fuel here or the other fuel by just setting what, by setting this to either one or four. Let's go ahead and set it to four since we have plenty of that type of fuel. Switch to receive true. And then what we're going to have to do is go ahead and turn on our pump here. And we might as well turn on this. And 
and this and this so we get our fuel system flowing again so we're set there so now it's time to craft a couple new things here so let's go ahead and bring up the recipe on how we make these So to make lasers, we need two diamonds, two obsidian, and some. So let's go ahead and make three of those. Oops. So we're going to need six diamonds, which of course I just passed. And six obsidian. And 15. Redstone. And the other thing we need to build. Not sure what they call it here, so let's see if I can find it. To assembly table. So that we're going to need a diamond gear, a diamond, and some more obsidian. So let's go ahead and request. Whoops! Again, I clicked on the wrong one. A diamond, a diamond gear, a redstone, and six obsidian. Okay, let's go ahead and make this one first. So, there's our assembly table. And our lasers. Let's go ahead and put our lasers up right here. And then put our assembly table right there. See how our engines are doing here. Looks like they're all full. So let's go ahead and start them running. And let's request, let's see. Oh, let's see. Let's Let's request a stack of iron. A stack of redstone. Looks like I have only two of those right now. So I'll get those requested. And let that all gather up here. And I'll be back as soon as that's all gathered. Okay, let's go ahead and open up our little table here. And we'll put in the iron and the redstone, which immediately lets us create the redstone chipset and the redstone iron chipset. Let me turn off that so we can actually see it. And then if I put this in, we can create wire. So the first thing I'm do is tell it to create wire here. And did I set this? I bet I didn't set these. So we'll set this one to... Huh. Could have sworn we'd use some. We're going to go ahead and set this to... Oh, no, I guess we only use 10. So let's go ahead and set that to 1. 
and set this one to one receive and there we have our little lasers up oh, and of course I didn't leave a chest there to catch it in so let's go ahead and request a chest here Oh, should be on this first screen chest one chest and we're just waiting for it to, meanwhile let's go ahead and set this to build our first chip set and there's our chest Go ahead and set down our chest here. And it should be working on its first chipset. Let's go ahead and stick our wire here in the chest. And now you can start building stuff we're going to need for an automated uh, system. Let's go ahead and check how my. Oh, everything looks like it's okay charged. And I think that's where we'll end the episode. I know this has been a rather short episode, and hopefully I'll get to another one today. But I wanted to get this set up and running so that we actually had some new production options in that. In that. So until next time, as always, if you enjoyed the episode, give me a like or leave me a comment. And if you're enjoying the series, go ahead and subscribe. Until next time, this is Spidey1958, and have fun Minecrafting.